<sighs> Damn, Q. Maybe you did that. Yo, 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 you know what it is, man. Everybody loves BBW, man. That's beers, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. Whole gang is back in the building, man. Got Angry Principal off camera. What's up? Got my man Bo in the building. I say. And of course, man, it's your boy Q Lewis holding it down live from the 48205, man. All right, so uh, we uh going to try something I've never tried before. I've uh I, I think Angry Principal said I did. I don't remember because like maybe we drink too much, but we go check it out. All right, so it's something called <laughs> like Barstown Bourbon. All right, so you see that right there is Barstown. Now, if you remember last week, we had a joint. Uh, what was the boogie? Yeah, the, the boogie one. <laughs> we had that yeah. one last, and it uh, it's uh, actually distilled at Bo uh, it was Barstown. Right? Barstown. It was sourced. Yeah. It was sourced. So I'm wondering, is this going to be similar to what we had last week? Um, Bo has had it before, so. Is there anything that you wanted to kind of give us a heads up on with it or like something you thought about it before? Make up your own mind. <laughs> I ain't trying to. Don't want to give us left. I ain't trying to sway nothing. Nope. But like, it do work that way though. Yeah, and like most times you see your bars down at the store, mm -hmm. that's still expensive. Okay. Mm -hmm. It is expensive. So yes. I, it's, it's turned me off from it because I don't necessarily want to spend that at that mm -hmm. time. Now, but when I saw this one, too. this is 50, 50 bucks. Okay. It's how much, and it's 100 proof. Yep. It's not bottle and bond, but it is. No, it is bottle and bond. Yeah, sorry, bottle and bond. It is bottle and bond. So, uh, but it's hundred proof, fifty bucks from Barstown. I was like, all right, I'm grabbing this one. Yeah, so that's how I got it. Because uh, for you, that's that's reasonably inexpensive right. in it, comparison. Okay, I got a couple bottles at home. I think I paid sixty for one okay. and eighty for the other one. So, yeah. yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, uh, let's get to it. We'll go pop this cork and see what it's doing. Paul's Straight from court. Barstown. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, a little weak uh, there. Yeah. What y'all getting off the nose? <laughs> a lot of vanilla. But it, it, okay. Just a whole I lot of vanilla. I ain't really want to say nothing. Not even French vanilla, just straight, straight vanilla. vanilla. Yep. That vanilla bean you get from Briars, mm -hmm. that's what yep. I'm smelling. Yep. Yep. There's something else, too, though. It's a fruit in there, but it's I don't know what it is. Yeah, what the fuck, though? Citrusy, I think. It's kind of a citrusy fruit, I think. Damn, like an orange cream sickle in this bitch. Caramel on the taste. Mm -hmm. Definitely caramel and vanilla for sure. And yeah, faint the hit of some, maybe some kind of citrusy, maybe a faint. <clears throat> that vanilla on the end. Oh yeah, absolutely. I'm not getting any citrus though. Not on the taste. On the smell, yeah, but not on the not on the taste. A little mind. maybe orange peel, like like maybe a little. If you put a little orange bitters in it and something. Okay, I can see that. You know, I can yeah. see that. That bitter, mm, yeah, that bitter yep, orange yep, taste. Okay, yep, I, yep. I can, I can taste yep. that. I like it though. Now at the end, you really getting that bitter mm -hmm. orange. Like you just chewed a little bit of the, uh, <laughs> of the skin. Just, yep, yep. Just a little bit of <laughs> right. It. Yeah, the little nasty white part on the right. orange. <laughs> That's what you get. This, this is hundred proof, right? Hundred proof. Hundred proof. Yeah. Okay. So. The, the my one thing, at the end is lingering yeah, too. Though. It, it, yeah, Damn, it's my, lingering like my one thing about it is like the hook. It's a slight hug, but it's not. I mean, I know it's only hundred proof, but it's not like <laughs> only. <laughs> <laughs> right. That's how bad we are. Exactly. That's how I was gonna say. It's not that hug that that, that hug hug. It, like, it ain't that scotch hug. Yeah, had, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely ain't that. that. That's that's a good example. Yeah, yeah. the motherfucker. The bourbon we had though, and then had, man, it had a hug like. Boy, it was one of one of the uh, the joints from from uh, Taste of Black Spirits. Can't remember the name of it now. Damn, I can't remember now. Anyway, yeah, but yeah, we yeah. go we go review that. At least back the to you. taste lingers. It does. It does linger. It's, it like does it's still linger. there. Yep. It's not a hug, but it does it's linger here. on the yeah. taste. Mm -hmm. Man, That's okay. cool. All right. Yeah, we go we go check this out. We go go to a commercial break though. You got our initial findings. Um, we go come back and give you that one to five Black Power Fist rating. And, Tell you uh, what you what we thinking about bars town. Mm -hmm. That's how you gotta say it, like bars. All right, we out here, man. You already know what it is, man. We be back after the commercial. Everybody loves BBW, man. You already know beers, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. Be back in a moment.
Visit the website right now, www.everybodylovesbbw. That's Beards, Bourbon, Whiskey, the podcast. Thank you guys for hanging out through the commercial breaks, man. You already know what it is. Everybody loves BBW. That's beers, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. <laughs> the gang is back, man. One to five black power fist rating. We was talking about something off camera, though. though. I want to get back to that about the uh, bars town and where we go from here. So, uh, Angry Principal, what was you saying about that? So, the reason I purchased this is because the other ones have been always at a price point. I didn't necessarily want to do at that time because right. I really hadn't heard enough people talk about it. Mm-hmm. Even though I know it's popular, I, I know Bardstown, Kentucky is a big deal. Mm-hmm. Right. I didn't necessarily want to, just because it says it's worth 80 mm-hmm. to 120, mm-hmm. I mean, I necessarily want to spend an 80 to 120. Mm-hmm. So I said, let me buy this one, see if it's actually worth moving into. And that's my question to y'all. What do y'all think? Is it worth trying that next price point? Yeah. So I've tried that, that the next price point up. I've got it at home, right? And um, it's good. I still don't think it's worth eighty. But um, once I'm done with it, I would re- I would replace it because, like like I mentioned off camera, it's a good change of pace for me. You know, mm-hmm. I've, I've got my you know. If y'all know y'all black culture out there. You remember the source, and you know they had the heavy rotation, right? <laughs> right. So this sure. ain't necessarily in my heavy rotation, but it, it was what, what up and comers or something like that. Right. And when it, that, that, yeah, this is. It's a nice change of pace for me. That's throwback I mean? for you hip hop niggas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a nice little change of pace. So um I would say if, if you okay with spending eighty just to kinda explore, then all right. But I wouldn't necessarily recommend someone to go out there and and pay eighty to one hundred and twenty or one hundred thirty or yeah. at some places I've seen one hundred and fifty for a bottle. Okay. You know? I yeah. wouldn't recommend that. No. I don't think it's that good. Gotcha. But if you know you got a little extra couple extra, you know, dollars or whatnot, yeah, give it a try. Mm. So, I I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Again, I, I guess it would depend. I guess the, the story, it, it would have to be some kind of major story for me to go to the to the next level anyway. But I think at the the, night, the next price range is like the ones that you were talking about. Mm-hmm. I, it's probably a no for me, though. Unless, well, I guess i say this. The, the next level's up. How much higher does the proof go? I guess that's probably so your question. So, the 80, or I think it's normally 90, but I found it for 80 somewhere. Mm-hmm. It's like 110 proof, I think it is. Okay. You're right. Okay. Um, so yeah, there's a, there's a little bit more of a hug. Okay. The flavor profile is very similar. I would say it's a little bit more concentrated. Okay. You know what I mean? So you know, it's you get straight so, to what, the what, you, you get, yeah, yeah, you get straight to yeah, it. Yeah. Once you hit the palate, like you okay, this is this is what this is. Gotcha. You know what I mean? yeah. yeah. But uh, if you see it for any more than 80, 85, I would say you know, take <laughs> it's a pass. It's not, it's, not, it's not worth that much. No, yeah. No. Mm-hmm. And just thinking about uh, just thinking about this, and real quick, just to compare it to what we did last week, which I know is kind of sourced in the same place. Um, I, I'll say the one that we did last week was more com- complex, but this one tastes better. If that makes sense, I guess if it could borrow something from this into that. I think it would have made last week's a little bit better because this one actually this one tastes absolutely better, but it's just not as complex as what we did last week. But again, I don't think that. Yeah, I probably wouldn't go to the next level up. I'll just wait till y'all get in and see if I can get a sample. <laughs> <laughs> so on the on the one to five though, on the bars town, man. Uh we started with Bo last week, so we back to Angry Principal. Now how you wanna how you wanna rank this one, dog? One to five. Okay, so complex taste to me also add a little water, brings out the pepper at the end. Mm-hmm. Uh it the taste kind of lingers. Uh it's not a great hug, mm-hmm. but it's slightly there. Okay, yeah. Um, at fifty bucks, yeah, I'm replacing this bottle. Um, summer or winter drinker. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm definitely having. A, I'm not mixing it with anything. It's, I'm doing this straight. Maybe, mm-hmm. maybe an ice cube. One small ice cube. That's about it. Mm-hmm. So I'm probably gonna go three. three. Mm-hmm. I do like the taste on it. I'm definitely gonna replace it. Um, will I go through it real fast? It's possible. Uh, it's, it's possible. possible. It's possible. Am I going to move up into the other price points? I don't know yet. Yeah. I, I haven't made up my mind uh, if it's worth me moving up. I think this is a really good. This is a good starting point if you're going to venture into Barstown and the money. So okay. I'm going with a three. 
Mm-hmm. Um, because the price is good, it's bottle and bond. You know you're gonna get your hug. You're, mm-hmm. you're okay. It's complex taste, so I'm going with a three. I got you. All right, Bo, what'd you say? So, last few weeks, me and Angry Principal have been on the same wavelength. You know, I'm going with a three as well. Um, taste is like, like like we mentioned. The com- it's not as complex as last week, but I appreciate that about it. Right? Get that up right off the palate. I'm like, okay. Get that vanilla. Get that caramel. Good with that. Like your principal said on the finish, you know, it's, it's a little bit of a hug. You know, it doesn't, it's, it's not, it's not, it's, it's not a big one, but a slight mm-hmm. hug. But that vanilla taste for me, that vanilla ca- kind of lingers. Yeah. You know, I think, I think that's what I kind of like about it. You know, I, I like that vanilla caramel type mixture, right? For sure. In my bourbon. So, uh, at, at, at the $50 price point, I'll definitely replace it to my bar, you know? Yeah. Um, like I said, it's a change. It's a change of pace bourbon for me. So yeah, you know, I give it a solid three. Okay, all right, I can fuck with that. So I'm a uh, again. I like I like it. And at the fifty at the fifty ball, I think it's doable. Um, however, I think that last week I think I gave it a two. And I and I'll tell you this: I'm going to give this one a two point five, right? And the reason being is that again, like I said before, I do like the complexity of last week's, but this week it's just it tastes good. Like it actually tastes better. Um, it's more of a that mix that I was talking about last time about the uh, vanilla and caramel, just like you said. Um, I'm kind of used to that, and this gives you that, and you don't have to you don't have to try to figure out what's what. Like so, sometimes complexity is good, and sometimes it's just like, God damn, what, what, why for? <laughs> so I got this one. This one tastes better, so I'm gonna give it the point five up. I'm gonna give it a two point five at the fifty ball. Like I would grab it. Um, going up the levels though, I'm not sure yet because it does taste good, and I'm figuring at a higher proof it probably tastes even better. Uh, like I said, maybe a little bit more concentrated and maybe a little older. Um, so, again, I think I'll probably just wait till one of y'all get it and <laughs> see if I can get me a shot. But the 50 ball, though, I will replace it, though, for sure. So, I'm going to give it a 2.5 for so, sure. So, Bardstown got a lot of versions. Yeah, they do. They got I, yeah, a lot yeah, of expressions yeah. here. So you got I'm a lot looking here from. from single barrel to double barrel rise to I had a single barrel, you know, mm-hmm. it's okay. weeded bottle and bond. So they got a lot yeah. of expressions had that. to try. Mm-hmm. But I'm just one, wondering, am I going to spend that kind of money? Yeah, uh, to experiment. <laughs> this this does make me more interested than I was before, mm-hmm. and venturing to the next price level. So I probably will. Yeah, it's a possibility. All right, cool. I'll wait for you. All right, so on that <laughs> note, uh, <laughs> we go get out of here. Uh, but again, man, across the board, we got uh, two threes and a two point five dollars. So definitely favorable. Um, does sound like we're suggesting uh, this actual expression. But again, make sure that you check it out for yourself and see what you like, because uh, you know everybody's palate is different. Up oh, um, there we go. There you go. Yep. I'll show you on the side. Yeah. <laughs> That's it, man. Till the next time. You already know what it is. Everybody loves BBW, man. That's beers, bourbon, whiskey, the podcast. Whole gang is in the building, but we about to be outside the building. My man, Angry Principal, off the camera. Drink what you like, how you like. My man, Bo, in the building. Black jobs. (laughs) (laughs) Hey, I said, yo. Black jobs. Black jobs. (laughs) It's your boy, Q Lewis, man. Holding it down live from the 48205, man. Peace out, man. (laughs) Black jobs. (laughs) 